Hi, in this video I'm going to scare the bejesus out of you regarding the speaking exam. You're probably worried about doing the speaking part of the exam, and you should be. Points wise, this is easily the part of the exam where you can gain most points, or if you do badly, lose most points. And that's all because of the way it's marked. Now, you'll probably know that there'll be two people examining you. This is what they'll be doing. The dude or dudette who sits in the corner there saying nothing will be marking you in four different ways. And that person will be thinking about grammar and vocabulary, discourse management, pronunciation and interactive communication. The mark for the fifth criteria is given by Mr or Mrs Chatty who will be asking you the questions. And that's for global achievement, which is very important. We'll come back to that later on. So let me take those five areas and break them down for you. Grammar and vocab is easy enough. Use lots of vocab and grammar and use it well. So when they ask you those simple questions at the beginning, don't just look at the person with attitude and say, yeah, nah, or dunno. Get stuck in and show off your language skills. Discourse management is about talking without hesitation, being relevant, organizing your ideas well, and linking it all, of to linking it all together using cohesive devices. Easy peasy. Pronunciation is all about sounding like Joanna Lumley and not as if you've drunk five beers, and good stress on words, and good stress in sentences. Interactive communication simply marks you on how well you communicate with Mr or Mrs stressed candidate who will be next to you. Now, global achievement is about how well you answer in general. Being able to deal with a number of different tasks and topics well with little hesitation or language craziness. Easy peasy lemon squeezy, I think you'll agree. Okay, now here's the frightening bit, the scoring. As mentioned, you're scored out of five for each section, but the marks you get from Mr. and Mrs. Smiles, who's in the corner over there, are doubled. The score you get from Mr. and Mrs. Chatty in front of you are quadrupled. Quadrupled, that's times four. Multiplying results if you do well is fantastic. Multiplying them well if you do badly, well, that sucks. I don't want to scare you unduly, but the facts are the facts. So just make sure you've done your preparation before you do this part of the exam. OK, now go and see the other videos about the other parts of the paper and see how they're scored and make sure you know how the paper is scored overall. 